Let us learn about quadrilaterals today. A quadrilateral is a plane figure consisting of four line segments which enclose a part of a plane. Here on this board, you can see a quadrilateral A, B, C, D which is bounded by four line segments A, B, B, C, C, D and A, D. Now inside is the plane region and the four line segments are said to be the sides of the quadrilateral. Now <coughs> The sides AD and AB intersect at A. So A we say is a vertex of the quadrilateral. In the same way sides AB and BC intersect at B. B is another vertex. BC and CD intersect at C. C is another vertex and CD and AD intersect at D, so D is another vertex. So a, a quadrilateral is enclosed by four line segments AB, BC, CD and AD and it has four vertices A, B, C and D. Now this is the plane region of the quadrilateral all points lying in this plane region of the quadrilateral are said to be in the interior of the quadrilateral. All points lying outside the plane region and the line segments are said to be in the exterior of the quadrilateral. And all the points lying on these line segments like E is a point lying on the line segment BC. So E is a point on the quadrilateral. The line segments together with the planed region, they form what is known as the quadrilateral region. Next we come to the word adjacent. Now see, look at my three fingers. The middle finger is next to the first finger. And same way, this finger is next to the middle finger. So when the two fingers are next to each other, we say they are adjacent to each other. This finger is adjacent to this finger. And this finger is adjacent to this finger. So in the quadrilateral also have a look at the two sides AB and BC. They are next to each other. So they are adjacent sides. In the same way BC and CD are next to each other. CD and AD are next to each other. And AD and AB are next to each other. So we have four pairs of adjacent sides in the quadrilateral AB and BC. B, C and C, D, C, D and A, D and A, D and A, D. Now, angle between any two adjacent sides is called the angle of the quadrilateral. Here, angle A is between sides A, B and A, D. Angle, a, B, angle B is between sides A, B and B, C. Angle C is formed by sides BC and CD and angle D is formed by the adjacent sides CD and AD. So we have four angles in a quadrilateral and the four angles are angle A, B, C and D. Now these four angles, let's see what are the adjacent angles to these. Angle A and B are next to each other. So angle A and B are adjacent angles. Same way B and C are next to each other. They are adjacent angles. C 
C and D are next to each other. They are adjacent angles and angle A and angle D are also adjacent angles. So a quadrilateral has four pairs of adjacent angles. Same way the vertices A and B, B and C, C and D and A and D are next to each other. So they are adjacent vertices. So we have A and B, B and C, C and D and D and A as adjacent vertices. Now let us come to the sides AB and CD. They are in front of each other. So we call them as opposite sides. AD and BC are in front of each other. So there, this is another pair of opposite sides. Now angle A and angle C are in front of each other. So angle A and angle C are opposite angles. Same way angle B and angle D are opposite or in front of each other. So they are opposite angles. So a quadrilateral has two pairs of opposite sides, two pairs of opposite angles. Now let's consider the vertices. A vertex and C vertex are opposite to each other. When we join two opposite vertices, we get a diagonal of a quadrilateral. On joining A and C, we get the diagonal AC. In the same way, when we join the opposite vertices B and D as they are in front of each other, we get the second diagonal of the quadrilateral BD. Next, what we come to is the perimeter of a quadrilateral. The perimeter of a quadrilateral is the sum of the lengths of all the sides of the quadrilateral. So when we add the lengths of all the sides of the quadrilateral, perimeter of the quadrilateral is equal to AB plus BC plus CD plus AD. And now we come to the sum of the angles of the quadrilateral. The quadrilateral has four angles. The sum of all the four angles of the quadrilateral is equal to 360 degrees. So in this, angle A plus angle B plus angle C plus angle D is equal to 360 degrees. I will show this with an activity. On this sheet, I have drawn a quadrilateral. The outline is red in color and the angles have been marked as 1, 2, 3 and 4. Now I tear this quadrilateral into four parts along this cracked line. Now once I tear the quadrilateral into four parts, I have stuck the four parts on this sheet. Now what I do is, I bring all the angles at one point. Now all the angles are now, the vertices of all angles is at one point. So I paste these in such a way that angle one Angle 2, angle 3 and angle 4 have a common vertex here. Now the sum of all these angles I have to find out. Now what is this angle called? It is a complete angle. And how much is a complete angle equal to? 360 degrees. So we have proved that the sum of all the angles of a quadrilateral is equal to 360. 60 degrees. Let's do a few questions now. Which side is opposite to side AD of the quadrilateral? BC is opposite to AD. Which side is adjacent to side AD? 
AB and CD are sides adjacent to the side AD. Which angle is adjacent to angle A? Angle B and angle D are adjacent to angle A. Which angle is opposite to angle B? Angle D is opposite to angle B. Name any two opposite vertices. A and C are opposite vertices. Which diagonal is formed by joining the opposite vertices B and D? Diagonal BD is formed by joining the opposite vertices B and D. Now what is the sum of all the angles of a quadrilateral? 360 degrees. Three angles of a quadrilateral are equal. Each of these angles, equal angles, is equal to 100 degrees. Can you find out the fourth angle? Oh yes. All the four angles is equal to 360 degrees. Three angles sum up to 300 degrees. So the fourth angle will be equal to 60 degrees. So now you interact with your friends and ask each other such simple questions. If you enjoyed this video, then please like it, share it and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.